Hi there, welcome to WP Math. Here in this video, we are going to be learning about FAQ widget of Elements Kit plugin. Open up any page with the Elementor page builder. After that, from the widget search panel, search FAQ. There you'll find the FAQ widget by Elements Kit. Drag and drop the widget on your page. After that, you'll find some simple FAQ content. Now in the left side, you'll find some control to modify this one. Let's start from the table content. In the table content, you'll find all the heading of this FAQ widget. Now if you open up any of them, they'll find the title and the content. Changing the text in the title control, you'll be able to change all the title from here. Like from the first one, I'm going to write 1, 2. It's all about the testing purpose just to show you how it works. And there you can see in the first title that I have 1 and 2 text. After that, you have the content area, there you can change the answer of the questions. That means this body part of this title. Alright, if you want to add a new one, on that time you have to click add item and they will find some dummy text and similarly you can change the title and the content. If you want to delete any of them, just click on this cross button. Alright, now if you go to the style tab, there you will have all the control to modify the color and the typography and the font size. The first one is the title tab, there you have the title color, typography and the background type. From the title color, you'll be able to change any sort of color you want or you can also work with the opacity of the color. After that, you have the typography. If you open up this typography control, there you'll have the font family, font size, width, text decoration, line height and letter spacing. From the font size, I want to use 2D pixel font size and the font family I want to use is Poppins. After that, you have the background type. From here, I'll add a little bit red background. And the other settings are the border type and the border radius, title padding, title margin. Now, these settings are very simple. If you use the title padding, it will make a bit of spacing into this red area. As an example, I'm going to reduce the right margin 20 pixel from the 40 pixel and left margin I want to reduce to 20 pixel again. So this is how you can work with the padding of this title. After that, if you go ahead and open up this content, they will have the same controls like this body color, typography, background type and the similar settings like the title, as an example, the padding and the border radius. These are the same setting that you have already seen in the title tab. Just to show you how it works, I want to reduce the content padding top to 10 pixel and the content padding bottom to 10 pixel. After that, the background type, I want to use a little bit dark. If you want to work with the responsive devices on that time, from here, you need to choose the responsive device. As an example, I'm going to choose the mobile device. After that, I'm going to reduce the title font size. So from the title tab, again, I have to go to typography. And from here, I'll reduce the font size to 16 pixel. And right now, if I go to the desktop device again, and there I'll find the title is 20 pixel, but for the mobile device, is 16 pixel. So this is how we can work with the FAQ widget of the Elements Kit. Thank you for watching this video.